In this video I will talk about course overview of Cadia V5. In this course I have included 6 modules that are very important for design and manufacturing industry. These industry specific modules will help you to get good job in design and manufacturing industry. Let's take a look on these 6 modules. In this course 1 module for 2D geometry creation, 3 module for 3D geometry creation, 1 for the assembly design and last for creation of drawing sheet. You will start learning CADIA from 2D geometry module sketcher. In this module, we will create 2D geometry. That geometry will work as an ingredient for all 3D design modules. That's why we will start learning CADIA from this module. This module is also very easy and similar like to AutoCAD. Then you will learn 3D design modules. In this modules we will use part modeling workbench to design any kind of 3D solid object. Some examples made on this workbench is Wheel rim, bearing Piston, nut bolt etc. Next workbench is generative sheet metal. This workbench will help us to design sheet metal object like CPU box, SMPS box, stapler, any product that is made of single seat by using cutting, bending, punching and folding process can be created on generative sheet metal workbench. In the next wireframe and surface design workbench we will create outer surface body of different products. Example stapler plastic body, trimmer and hair dryer body, helmet and mouse outer body. We also use it to design digital concept of airplane surface, car design and bike design. In the next module is assembly design workbench. In this workbench you will how to assemble solid, sheet metal and surface parts into one final product. Like assemble all parts of mountain board to make his working 3D model in computer. And in the last module is drafting workbench. Here you will learn how to create drawing sheet to print objects orthographic and section view with dimension and tolerance for manufacturing. So in this whole course you are going to learn solid, sheet metal and surface part designing and assembly design with sheet creation. Let's know history of this software. CADIA Full Form is computer-aided tridimensional interactive application. This software was developed by company Dassault System under French aircraft company Dassault Aviation. Founder of this company was Avian Marcel Dassault. He was French aeronautical engineer who developed propeller-based fighter jet during World War I. Later he established his own company as Dassault Aviation. In 80s he relished complication to develop new fighter jet and upgrading the existing fighter jet through conventional method. At that time engineers used drafting sheets to draft part for manufacturing. But that method take lots of time and handling the sheet was hard task. So he decided to use computer to solve this problem by developing CAD software for design and manufacturing work. Development of software was started in 1981 and first version was released in 1982 as CADIA version 1. Version 2 released in 1984, version 3 in 1988 and version 4 in 1993. At that time CADIA became most popular and many big company were using it as their main software. And most popular version CADIA V5 was released in 1998. In this video course I am using CADIA version 5, R21 released in 2011. Let's talk about requirement to learn it and scope of this software. Where we can get job after learning the software. Anyone with engineering or technical degree can learn this software. This software is not for those students who don't have technical background. If you are engineering student then this software will help you to design your college project. You can also take 3D print using it. Scope of this software is very large you'll found mostly big companies using this software as design software. Some example of companies which are using CADIA. Indian customers General Aeronautics, Suprajit, Ashok Leyland, Sandhar, Royal Enfield. Global user Tesla, BMW, Solar Impulse, Land Rover, Jaguar, Ashok Leyland, Suprajit, Royal Enfield, Yamaha, Airbus, Finairline. We can say the scope of this software is very huge and many industries using it.